We're now going to look at uh, getting some free brushes from the internet and this is one of my favorite sites allfreedownload.com there are actually things uh, images and so forth that uh, still have their layers so you can you can work on uh, PSD files there's several of those available uh, right here is the PS brushes, Photoshop brushes. So if you click that, you'll be taken to lots and lots of brushes inside here. Most of them are free. Some of them want to be mentioned. Uh, they want you to give them credit. I always avoid those particular brushes. But let's say for right now, I want a, the Planet brushes number two. I like to work on sci-fi stuff so, for my own entertainment if nothing else so I'm gonna click right on that and here's the download for it and here's where it tells about it it also says Lady Victoria license it's free some of these click for license and you read all the stuff some of them will say you can do whatever you want with it but you need to you know put a credit in there for my efforts so they want you to, uh, if you create something, to give them some credit. I don't, if I work on something in Photoshop uh, and come up with a nice uh, creation, I certainly don't want to give credit to somebody that allowed me to put a little bit of hair on somebody's head or something like that. It's, it's kind of ridiculous. So I avoid those. But let's just click on here. And I always... Um, instead of open it I tell it to save it and if you're using um, Firefox I, and I really like this about it, I'm going to go ahead and click OK up here it shows you that it's downloading and obviously this is a pretty good sized file so it's going to take a few minutes but once it loads I can well I can go ahead and click on that now and you can watch it load it's a 14 meg file and it's probably coming from a very slow server. One thing that I really am a firm believer in is using, uh, if they're zip files, I like to scan them before I open them because some uh, zip folders can contain problems. And um, let me just show you, if you type in your browser Windows Security Essentials, you click right on here to, to look at this one and this is totally free you just have to tell it you know if you're using Windows Vista regular Windows 7 32-bit I am using Windows 7 64-bit so I just click it click download now you need to this kind of auto updates but you gotta kinda keep an eye on that but this is the greatest virus protection program uh, that I've found does a really good job and it's totally free Windows is trying to protect their credibility and so they provided this for Windows users for free so what I do now let's just uh, let me get rid of that my download is done so I'm going to click back up here again here's my planet brushes and I'm going to drop that on my desktop and let me show you where that is it's right here and I, before I open it, I right-click on it and say Scan with Microsoft Search Security Essentials. It scanned it, no threats detected, so I'm at peace opening the file. So I double-click on it. There's my brush set. I'm just going to click and drag that to my desktop. So let me get this out of the way. And here is that particular brush set. I'm going to throw this in the trash. I don't need that anymore. And then I'm going to go into Photoshop. So let me open Photoshop real quick. And now that I'm in Photoshop, I want to load that new brush set, the uh, Lady Victoria with it. That seems, uh, oh yeah, Lady Victoria Planet. So I'm going up here to click on the brush. And right over here where the little gear is and the down arrow, I want to click right on that and go down here where it says Load Brushes. So this is going to let me look anywhere on my computer for the brush set. 
and my brush set is on the desktop and it is right here Lady Victoria Planets now I just happened to have downloaded some others today too so I'm going to go ahead and select those see if it'll let me do it nope I gotta do it one at a time so I'm gonna go ahead and get Lady Victoria Planets and click on over here click on the load button now the last set down here are the planets so you can see the different uh, planets and let me get back out of here let me just come up with a new document and wow that's a big planet maker there's not a very good color let's let's go with something blue and if I click it several times you see it fills in a little bit better so we've got several that time that are little planets whoa big planets in this case lines there's a kind of a broken up planet let's see let me zoom in what it looks like kinda cool isn't it and then we just uh, change colors at will this is going to be a sickly planet. The more you click it, I'm just clicking several times, the more it fills in and so forth. And you can overlap these as well. So you see, you can actually see through it. All right, that's uh, getting these free brushes and, and downloading them and putting them inside Photoshop to use later. Remember, uh, this website all-free-download.com and you can get tons of Photoshop stuff so here's free PSD so all of these things uh, if you click on them and download them and put them in in Photoshop these particular things give you um, layers and so forth but you see we've got Photoshop styles We've got fonts, we've got wallpapers, uh, so lots of cool stuff on this website. Talk to you all later.